Hey everyone, thanks for checking out another bonus episode of The New Marketing Show. Catching us on Instagram TV, YouTube, Podbean, Apple Podcasts, all that good stuff. So today on Instagram, I posed a question. What are you doing to make sure that you retain all of the clients that you had before you know, the non-essential business shutdown? So a couple of ideas you know, that I have you know, for some industries would be, how can you partner if you can't serve your existing client base right now right <clears throat> how can you partner with other people and collaborate with them and maybe pull everyone together so that you can pull your resources and give your clients a unique offering you know a lot of this goes for the fitness space i see a lot of private gyms you know and small gyms closed right now <clears throat> but they're not doing anything to maintain their client base why not partner with an online fitness source and you know maybe negotiate a reduced rate for each of your members, still bill your members, then you pay the online system, and there you are. You're providing value. The whole thing that's gonna that the whole thing, the whole key ingredient and the whole key thing to maintaining your client base and keeping all of your clients during this stuff is constantly providing value while you can't serve them or while you can't you know, solve their designated problems or while you can essentially work with them and, 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 and help them. So what value are you adding to a relationship? It's always about the value. <clears throat> if you're not adding value to your client base and to your existing clients, they're going to go somewhere else. And that's whether your business is open or shut down. So right now, you know, a couple things. One, are you staying in touch with all your clients? Are you active on social media on your channels? If you have an email list, and again, I've been saying this since the beginning of all of this stuff that happened in March, your email list right now is one of your most valuable assets to your business. How are you utilizing the business, your business list to make sure, your email list, to make sure that you are still communicating with your clients, to let them know where you are, to let them know whether or not you're gonna open when all this shit gets lifted. Because that's a big question for a lot of people. A lot of clients we're working with right now, we're working on reopening plans and messaging to let people know that, hey, we are still in the game. We're gonna be here when this lifts. Thank you for bearing with us. We would love to hear from you. How are you doing? You know, There's a lot of key creative messaging that needs to happen around there. Are you continuing to change your business? Are you evolving? Are you, you know, did you move your business online? Are you telling everybody that you move your business online? How are you communicating with everyone? So right now, the clients that you have and the clients on your roster are more valuable than ever because they're sticking with you, they're supporting you, and they're helping you navigate these times. Treat them with that respect and treat them and show them that value. And I think that it's gonna really enhance the relationship. Hey, thanks for checking us out. Talk to you next time.